Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emily Freiblair. So today's video, I'm going to be trying out a couple of new products, a brow product and a mascara. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So I got two products here. I got a wet and wild brow product. This is called the Brow Maximizer. Looks like it has a powder and a gel in it, which I was very intrigued by and then also have the elf lash and roll mascara it says it is curling and lifting which this really reminded me of the concept of the benefit roller lash i really wanted to try it because obviously elf i love their stuff and also way more affordable than the benefit roller lash one of the things that i do have an issue with is keeping my lashes curled after i curl them right i curl them and then i'll put a lash primer on and mascara and they don't always stay curled so what i'm gonna do which is usually what i do when i try out new mascaras for videos is curl my lashes on both sides put lash primer on one side and non lash primer on the other and see how it goes so I'm gonna put lash primer on first, probably before we try out the brow product because I like it to get like kind of dry, honestly, on my lashes. Here we go. So the right side for me, so this side, is going to be the lash primer side. I'm gonna curl both sides. My favorite lash primer or mascara primer is the Essence Volume Booster Lash Primer. I love this stuff. I've gone through so many tubes of it and to be honest, I probably need a new one. So while that's getting like tacky and stuff, we're going to try this brow maximizer in neutral brown. So it has loose powder. Wait, it says loose powder fills and shapes and it's buildable. And then the gel says it's extreme hold gel and it dries clear. So that part's interesting. Let's see. I hate it when you do this. Okay, it says maximize your brow look with this duo dual-ended brow powder and gel maximizer. The loose brow powder is ideal for shaping and filling sparse areas while the gel fluffs, sculpts, and builds maximum volume and hold and dries down to a clear, natural finish. Wear them together to build dramatically full and fluffy brows. Interesting. It says for a laminated gel effect... Uh, or brow effect, brush brows up in an upward motion to do it. So what if this gave your brows that lash, that uh, lamination effect? That'd be awesome. I hate getting stuff out of these. Dude. Brow gel is on one side. See, this is what it looks like. Has a lot of gel on it. I'm going to have to wipe that off when I do it. And then this is the powder. And it says to wipe off the excess before you apply. So it's a very like stiff applicator, which I kind of like. So I'm gonna go in with this brow. So I'm going to try to kind of do like strokes a little bit and fill. The one thing I don't like about this is I can't use a spoolie before I do this, you know? Okay, it's definitely working. It's pretty natural looking, which I like. It's one thing I do like about powder is that it usually looks more natural than a pencil does. There's one, and then we're gonna go in with the gel. And yeah, there's a lot of gel on this, so I'm gonna scrape it off. And the spoolie's kinda big. Ooh, it is a very like thick gel it feels like glue you guys i like the spoolie because it's really wow it's really laminating them you guys okay i thought this was gonna be like a normal brow gel so we'll see how this dries but so far i like it we are waiting for this brow gel to dry right now and I'm going to do the lashes now. So let's start with the lash that does not have the lash primer on it. Here's what the brush looks like. It is nice and curved like that in order to get your lashes like curved up, I believe. So let's start on this side. Hmm. 
And I like my lashes very long and voluminous. So hopefully we can build this mascara up. After completely coating the lashes, that looks gorgeous, you guys. Very pretty. I just realized I didn't even read anything on this package. It says, get the curled lashes of your dreams with Lash and Roll's unique double-sided brush. The shorter bristles hold formula, while the longer bristles separate and lift lashes for maximum curl. The incredible long-lasting formula is freak and freak, flake and smudge resistant for your most dramatic lashes. Okay, so that's one coat. I really like the natural look of it so far. I think it looks really pretty. So let's go in with a little bit more and see if we can build it up. Oops, I just got some on my inner eye. Huh, I like it, you guys. It's making it very like PC and fluttery, but also making them long without clumping too much and this is without primer what the heck you guys obviously i'm gonna have to get that mascara off but i love it even without primer the heck i gotta get a bunch of mascara off of my eyes huh all right we're going in on the primer side why do i have a bunch of mascara all over my face I think I accidentally flung mascara little tiny particles all over my cheek and it looks like freckles. <laughs> Oops. Wow. Okay, so I can tell a slight difference with the primer, but like not much more so volume than anything. But so far, I love this mascara, you guys. It's so pretty. I will say I think this side without the primer is slightly curled more just because it doesn't have the other stuff of it weighing down like the lashes. So, wow. I'm impressed, you guys. Very, very, very impressed. I gotta go get this mascara off my face. <laughs> Look at this brow. It looks so good. It's like fluffy and natural looking. The hold feels amazing. All right, I cannot get over how good both of these products are. I'm gonna real quick do the other brow and then finish out this video. I can't get over this gel that feels like, you know, that really hard gel that people are using for the brows. Like it is amazing. They knocked it out of the park with this brow product. I am totally gonna be using this. This is my new favorite. 100%. All right, Wet n Wild hit it out of part, hit it out of the park with this brow product. The fact that they could get a brow lamination effect in a brow gel in a tube is absolutely incredible. Like I am so in love with it. It makes my brows look so fluffy and great. I love the color of it. I think it works amazing. The Mascara, I can't believe I actually like an e.l.f. mascara. I've never liked an e.l.f. mascara very much. Like, they've always been okay. They haven't been, like, great. And I think this is going to be my new favorite mascara. So, two 10 out of 10 products. I absolutely love them. And the best part is they're extremely affordable. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in video very, very soon. Bye, guys.